to see at the press conference a couple of weeks ago up in Sunset Park for the Nets coming over here to Brooklyn, really solidifying that by making the transition where they're going to be practicing here in Brooklyn from now on as opposed to out in New Jersey. It's been a down season for them, but really over the last few weeks, it, things, it seems like things are kind of turning around for a little bit. Uh, they're four and five since the All-Star break. They're playing a little bit better. Uh, certainly some losing could continue through the rest of the way, but they now have a ju new general manager in Sean Marks. They've solidified this move. Do you feel like there's some, a different level of positivity than there was as far as maybe a month or five weeks ago before some of these changes have happened? Well, you know, I think uh, uh, having been with the team a long time, I've seen some, some peaks and valleys, and uh, uh, all I can really say about it is, is it's nice to have some clarity with regards to leadership. And, and uh, I think uh, the experience that uh, Sean Marks will bring us from the Spurs with regards to the type of culture they're able to, to perpetuate there. And I don't know if you saw today, they just hired Trajan Langdon, who's a Duke guy, as the assistant GM. I mean, that, that to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my brother went to Duke, by the way, so I'm a big, I'm a big Duke fan. So, Yay, so uh, did I. Uh, <laughs> uh, did you? All right, very good. So, uh, 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 th so the answer is yes. And, and listen, I root for the Nets. I, 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 I follow Nets daily and, and kind of keep, keep abreast of how people are feeling about it. And, and, the, and, the, and the thing for me is if you really look at Brooklyn and, and just the, the type of identity that is Brooklyn, it's a gritty, hardworking, lunch pail type community that's like, I, I describe it as true. It's just without pretense, real, kind of in your face a little bit. And, 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 and all you have to do, from my, my opinion, and it's just my personal opinion, is have a team that, that is kind of built in the same fashion, right? Cares about the community, comes out, gives an effort. And I think that's what you're seeing. Like, you're right. They may, they may not win every time, but it's fun when they're in the game. It's interesting. And what I've seen over the past three seasons is the first year we were there and the Miami, the Miami Heat came to town, it was three-quarters Miami Heat fans because they could get seats right. relatively cheaply. Now you see, like, Real people really interested, and and it's very gratifying. At least for my, I'm not even part of management, right? I'm just there because you want you want the team to do well. It just provides a good feeling in and around the organization. And you're right now that they're here in Brooklyn. It's really, I think, I think good things are coming.